So I'm now going to talk about setting the clutch re-engagement control, otherwise known as the CRC, which is this little device here. Uh, it's, part, it's certainly an integral part of making sure that your uh, gear change is set up correctly on the semi-automatic gearboxes. So what you need is a two millimeter diameter pin, and in this instance I have a standard uh, pop rivet, which happens to have the right size pin. And you'll see in the body of the CRC there's a, a little hole there might well be a plastic plug in it, but so you take that plug out and when the throttle is in the idle position, when it's all connected up, this pin should slip right in, like that. With the pin in, you now cannot move the throttle because it's all, this, the, all the shafts are linked and it's now jammed by the pin. Take the pin out and you've now got your throttle movement back again. So in order to, let's assume that this is, is it, that it's not correct exactly, it's not set correctly and you can't get your pin in, you have to start by slackening off this clamp which links the CRC shaft to the throttle shaft. You then need to slide that back on its shaft such that it's disengaged from the intermediate wheel which connects the CRC to the carburetor. Then you need to do that clamp nut up again, which I'm struggling with. So just nip that up so that you can actually turn it by hand. So I can turn the shaft by hand. Yeah. So the next thing to do is to put the pin in. So the pin is in but it's obviously not going in its slot properly. So you need to rotate this little clamp but using your finger against the spring pressure of what's going on inside. But you need to hold the pin slightly with some tension such that you can find out when it needs to go into the slot. When it goes into the slot you'll find that there's a little bit of play but you can't turn it greatly in either direction. So you slacken off the, slacken off the clamp bolt once more such that you can then slide the clamp along the shaft and you need to get it to engage in the intermediate wheel and everything moves and doesn't want to go into line and you have to just wiggle it in and finally it'll all just go slot in nicely like it has just there. Finally tighten the clamp bolt, just nip it, doesn't have to be super tight. Because the pin's still in you can see I still can't operate the throttle, I'll take the pin out and there's the throttle. Double check, throttle back to idle position, pin goes in. That's the CRC now correctly set and you can now go on to do your clutch settings.